All right, listen up, fellas. And what you want to look at is you coming into your own. You want to get to where I am. See, we do a lot of, everybody in the city just ain't going to be able to use the bucket truck like I do. You're not going to have access to that. That take time to get up there. You're going to have to do a lot of back lot climbing. And a lot of people think in the utility that you got to have a climbing belt. No, you don't. I always have used my regular belt to climb a pole. The main thing you got to make sure is, man, and this is why it takes getting a degree. This is why you need an electrical degree like I got single phase and three phase. This is where the three phase come in at. This is where it come in at. You want to make sure that you get full extension around the pole and where you can hold it. This allow you to do that, man. Make sure your first step goes in. And now you don't, make sure you, your belt right. You want to make sure you plant that. That's your first plant, okay? Then you get up above yourself to where you can climb. It always start with my strong side. I'm right-handed. So if you're left-handed, it's fine to start left-footed. You know, you want to make sure you get the right foot. You don't need nothing but the right spikes, the right foot, so you can make that first plant, that first plant into your pole. That's the main thing you're doing. This is how you make 12 to $1,500 a week easy. A lot of times I'm two to 3,000 feet in the air on a pole. Now that's our pole because of... We might as well be in Carnival. <laughs> I let her sit, let her sit on the tip, yeah. She like to sit when she sit on the tip, yeah. She like to grind, say she grind on the tip, yeah. I let her whine when she whine on the tip, yeah. That's all she can handle is the tip, yeah. Ah, <laughs> uh, here we go, fellas. Watch him shine. Hey man, what you doing? I'm trying to teach an online pole climbing class. Well, man, I'm coming to work. Nah, you don't work for the city no more. Last time I saw you, you had a gun in my head. Man, don't start there. You know that ain't had nothing to do with that, man. I'm telling you now, man, listen to me. What you can do, you can take the shirt off because it's about to be police <laughs> everywhere. And where you get that bike from anyway? You stole that from somebody. Stole it, man. You crazy, man. Look, I called me a boy. You stole that because you ain't got no degree. It sounds good, man. I called me a boy with some Louise. Woo! Paid I off. knew that was you. Them jokers paid off. You stole them Louis from me and no, sold it and bought this. It wasn't nothing like that, man. I caught a dude over there on the other side of town, man. He had these things, man. What was he wearing when you robbed him? I ain't robbed him. I bought him. I got him wholesale. Look, that don't even matter. Look, let go So work, you man. bought the Louis that I had? I bought I the Louis and flipped them and went and got this, baby! <laughs> yes, sir. That thing look, look good, don't it, man? You ain't got one of these. <laughs> look good. I got a Harlem, but not like that. Hey, the mayor ain't buying nothing like this. I promise you, the mayor ain't gonna get you nothing like this. He can get me one, but you don't want one. Take that off, man. You fired. You fired, dog. You can't fire you me. Can get on whoever bike you stole. And I'm finna report that to the police. Man, listen. Man. Take the shirt off, man, before I hit you, man. Before you hit who? That's straight up. Cause you had your little pistol on you last time. I know it was you. I don't know what you're I know it was you when man, I said, look, it, when I asked, is this you know Corey what? you ran off? You know what? You can have the job. You can have this shirt. You're good, Jack. You know, think about what you're doing, good, man. Jack. You're benefiting. But don't ever raise no weapon up in Think about room. what you're doing, man. I'm telling you, I'll knock you out. It sounds good. You don't need to quit, <laughs> man. You got good. kids. Look, quit. You just fired me. But look, I already had this in mind. I already knew what you was going to do. I, I knew you was going to hate. Man. I knew you I was going to hate. No little motorcycle. I, I knew you was going to hate. I knew you were going to hate. One thing about it, you need me. Because if you fire me, you got to do the work. Tell me I took something from you, man. I ain't never took nothing from nobody in, you in my life, me, man. man. I know you did. Man, all right. You wanted them Louise, and that's how you bought this. You ain't never worked, man. You never had a degree. But you won't be able to make $1,200 a week nowhere else. <laughs> I can sell this for way more if I want to, but I'm not. And you say you bought the Louise from a dude. Well, don't worry about it. You can have your little hey, job, man. Jack. You can have your little job, Jack. Listen. Listen, Corey. Go on, see what you got to say. I'm going to ride. You can have your little job. I'm going to go have fun. You got airbags on there? I got all that on here. And all that That's on here. That's a big, long wheel. 26. Two to six. You fired, dog. 